Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing about drug calculation of injection diltiazem. Before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notification. Let's get into the session. What is injection diltiazem? Injection diltiazem comes under the brand name Cardizem. It comes under the class calcium channel blockers and the therapeutic classification will be antiarrhythmic. So, when is the drug diltiazem indicated? In case of atrial fibrillation or atrial flutter, paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia, hypertension, angina pectoris. Now, how is the drug available? It comes in vial form with one vial containing 5 ml containing 25 mg of strength. Let's discuss about the dosage of injection diltiazem for adults. Initial bolus is 0.25 mg per kg over 2 minutes. The second bolus is given only when necessary which will be after 15 minutes of initial one and the dose will be 0.35 mg per kg over 2 minutes. In cases of continuous intravenous infusion, the duration of the infusion will be 24 hours. The recommended initial infusion rate of diltiazem injection is 10 mg per hour. The infusion rate may be increased from 5 mg per hour to 15 mg per hour as needed. Some patients may maintain response to an initial rate of 5 mg per hour. Now, how do we prepare the infusion? The IV compatible solutions for diluting injection diltiazem are dextrose 5%, normal saline 0.9% and normal saline 0.45%. Now, for a standard infusion of injection diltiazem, we mix 5 vials of injection diltiazem, that is 25 mg in 5 ml in 100 ml normal saline. When we look at this picture, 1 vial equals 5 ml, that is 25 mg, therefore 5 vials of diltiazem contains 25 ml equaling 125 mg of strength. Therefore, total volume is 125 ml containing 100 ml normal saline and 25 ml of diltiazem with 125 mg of strength and the concentration will be 1 mg per ml. Let's get into the example. Doctor's prescription for injection diltiazem infusion is injection diltiazem 5 mg per hour. The formula will be desired dose multiplied by quantity divided by available dose which gives the ml per hour. Now, desired dose is 5, quantity will be 125 ml, available dose is 125 mg. Therefore, applying all into the formula, we get the answer 5 ml per hour. Now, second example is injection diltiazem 10 mg per hour. Here, the desired dose is 10 Quantity is 125 ml, available dose is 125 mg, applying all into the formula we get the answer 10 ml per hour. Next example, injection diltiazem 15 mg per hour, desired dose is 15, quantity is 125 ml, available dose is 125 mg, applying all into the formula we get the answer. 15 ml per hour. The calculation will be very easy if the drug is prepared as mentioned before in the standard infusion with 5 vials of injection diltiazem diluted in 100 ml in us. Next comes the nursing consideration while infusing injection diltiazem. Monitor BP and pulse prior to therapy during dose titration and periodically during therapy. Monitor intake and output and daily weight. 
Check for the signs of heart failure such as peripheral edema, crackles, dyspnea, weight gain, and jugular venous distension. Patients receiving digoxin concurrently with calcium channel blockers should be monitored for the serum digoxin levels. Also, monitor for signs and symptoms of digoxin toxicity. Generally, serum calcium concentrations are not affected by calcium channel blockers. But it's very important to monitor serum potassium periodically because hypokalemia increases the risk of arrhythmias and hence should be corrected. So this is all about drug calculation of injection diltiazem. If you find this video useful, please like it and please subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.